Hello everyone, welcome to the funeral roast of the Try Guys. I am Redacted, I am a podcaster and truth seeker. I just like to quickly plug my podcast called Why the Government is Trying to Kill You, sponsored by Squarespace. (laughs) Before I begin, I think we need to address the elephant in the room. Thanks, man. (laughs) (laughs) Boom. (laughs) On to the reason I am here. I have committed the past 10 years of my life uncovering conspiracies about the Try Guys, and today I am going to reveal all of them. Everyone likes to talk about the Try Guys, but nobody has ever asked why, guys. (laughs) Okay. (laughs) Sure, you may think they're just some innocent guys that look like they're in some kind of retired ska band. (laughs) But don't be fooled, they're in the pockets of big corporations. Zach is funded by Big Oil, and Keith is funded by Big Mouth. (laughs) (laughs) Have you ever actually thought who loves the Try Guys? Saying you love the Try Guys is like saying you love that channel that comes on when you go into your hotel and you turn on the TV. (laughs) No, the Try Guys are at the front of every major government psyop. As we all know, the CIA funded modern art to increase patriotism. The CIA funded the Try Guys to decrease patriotism. (laughs) Because there's something so grossly American about getting paid to make cakes poorly? (laughs) But the conspiracies don't stop there, folks. They are using a fake Eugene to film their videos. Yeah, that's right. I know it's very hard to tell, but if you look closely, you will see that when Eugene isn't there to film, which is often, (laughs) they're using a scarecrow with concealer. (laughs) Now, surprisingly, that scarecrow puts in just about as much effort as Eugene does, so (laughs) it's really hard to notice. (laughs) I mean, just look at their series. Eat the Menu is to promote obesity. Without a recipe is a psyop by the Barefoot Contessa to sell more cookbooks. (laughs) And their vlogs, well, their vlogs are just plain bad. (laughs) Now here's another truth bomb. The Try Guys movie and Keith's off-Broadway production were a conspiracy for the Try Guys to lose thousands of dollars. (laughs) That's good. That's good. good. Look, you can find out all these things if you just pay attention. And much like the Try Guys, you have conspiracies. That's right. (laughs) Shane Top is trying to do the splits in the hopes that his balls will finally drop. (laughs) (laughs) Stupid. I love it. Arasha was born after 9-11, which is a government conspiracy to make me feel old and really bad about myself. (laughs) (laughs) Now, Chance, you and me share in this conspiracy. Chance believes the Earth is flat. However, that's only because his whole personality is two-dimensional. Whoa! My God! Good. Now, Kelsey here is a friend of the Try Guys, also on their podcast, Guilty Pleasures. Kelsey, you may not know, has chronic pain. What you don't know is she uses that chronic pain to distract from the pain of being chronically unfunny. Oh, oh my God. Gosh. Damn. Oh, I love it. <laughs> <laughs> Damien Haas. Oh, God. (laughs) You know, last time I dropped a pretty heavy fact on you uh, about you being (laughs) unfuckable. I'm sorry, but blame the government. But I have an even larger truth bomb to drop on you guys today. And I don't know if you're going to be ready for this. 
Damien Haas is white. <gasps> what? That's about it for me, but I just have uh, one more important thing to share with everyone that the government does not want you to know. Oh, if you go to smosh.com oh right God. now, <laughs> there is a new great roast shirt that you can purchase. Get your bag. It's pretty awesome. It's pretty awesome. Now. Stay safe, and I hope you're watching this through a VPN. <laughs>